says guys this is nearly last and welcome in this video what we're gonna be doing is another guys and tips video this time guys we're gonna be concentrating on the game mode hardpoint and on the new map splash now this is the hardpoint locations we've got number one is in that open area in the center number two is in that room down at the bottom we've got about three entrances exits then number three is out in the open once again and then with number four which is the, probably the smallest hardpoint I've ever actually seen and that is in that little corridor there at the top now if you're gonna come through this kind of location guys it is a lot more riskier because you're quite exposed. You've got this window here. They can circulate all the way around from the yellow tube from behind you. If you pop around here, you're going to be able to see them coming from there, but they can catch you out. And also, they can circle around and come up from that pink tube from behind. Now, this is where I like to be in the water, especially if your teammates are actually on the hard point. There's no point you being in there. You can just try to hold down here. People don't tend to notice you as well. Now, if you're attacking from this direction, and if you think that the enemies are going to come up through this kind of way once again, what you can do now is just jump out the water. You can go out here, take a couple of enemies out, and it pops straight back into the water again. Now, once again, if we do attack from this kind of direction, but the enemies are coming from the other direction, what we can do now is circulate all under the water. People don't really tend to notice you, like I say. Be a bit mindful of people swimming up to you, though. And when we're just going to get into this particular corner here. Now, from here, people shouldn't really notice you, because when they look out this tube, you're all going to be down there in the bottom right hand corner they're going to be concentrating on that yellow tube the window the walkway and even if people come along the walkway the last place that they're going to be looking is in that bottom right hand corner now as soon as you know or roughly where they are you feel confident you can jump straight out get attack mining and start taking your enemies out now with location number two now this is the area that I actually like to hold down now once I get up into here if I see my teammates especially are on the hard point I'm gonna just leave them to it I'm gonna just try and patrol this kind of area even if you're attacking from the other side you can come up that way and then drop down and circulate from this kind of area as well what I don't like to be is on the other side. Now, once you're on the other side, there's so many different ways for you to die. You know, there's lots of little different rooms and cover that people can catch you out on. Here, you can see everyone quite clearly. If your teammates are coming under fire or anything else like that, you can drop into the hard point like this, pick up a weapon, you know what I mean? Just go on, just camp it out a little bit and just hold down that particular hard point. Now, on location number three. Now, with this one, if you're going to come from the sand, what you're going to do is you're going to try and use this bit as a bit of cover because straight where you know they're going to be coming from the other side. If you're going to come up and flank around the back of the house we've got here, we're going to have to be a bit more mindful. People coming from the right or coming up through that house and especially people coming up from the left-hand side as well. But if we're attacking from this kind of direction, guys, be a bit more mindful of those little rooms there. But best way for me personally is not just to jump straight onto the hard point from this side, but use this house as a bit of cover. As you can see, you just drop straight out there. You can take someone out, walk onto the hard point. If your teammates are quite happy to be sitting on there, you can just drop straight back into the room and just protect them from inside this house. If you're standing out here in the open, you get caught out quite easily. But then obviously, you've got to be a bit more mindful of the water. Now, this is the last hard point location. As you can see here, it is very, very small indeed. You're just going to come up through that little walkway there. If you come up that way, you just have to be mindful of that long line of sight there if people are trying to hold that down. But the best way to actually attack if you're coming from this kind of direction is this because it's such a small narrow corridor everyone gets bunched up together and you can have an absolute field day this is one of the moments i've had on it and i've had plenty more since i mean it's absolutely brilliant how small it is it can get a little bit chaotic with all, lots of grenades and whatnot else being flown in there but you can drop back here circle back round catch people out from this kind of area straight away so for me personally that is probably my most favorite one because it's very simple where people are going to be coming from and if you have a good moment there you can take people out quite easily and then you can be circling around onto once again onto the first hard point and you can drop round back onto the water once again but i hope you found this guys tips video useful but coming up on my screen now is my subscribe button make sure you're jumping on that and guys if you drop a like on this video and support my channel it'll be even better this is nearly last and i'll catch you later